Okay, welcome back to Florida Naturally. We have Art Yuri in here, manager of the Homosassa Springs State Wildlife Park. Hi, Art. Hey, good morning. It's another year, isn't it, with uh, with Lou the Hippo? Another year, another great year. <laughs> he's, uh, wh when was he born? 1960? Yeah, he's actually turned 51 years this year. Uh -huh. His mother lived to be about 54, so mm -hmm. he is getting up there, but hopefully we'll still have several years to uh, have more birthday parties. Well, I think he looks great. Uh, now, uh, someone wrote a song. What, what was her name that wrote a song for Lou? That was Vicki Ioza. Mm -hmm. She uh, is a volunteer here. Uh -huh. She actually helps clean the hippo and make his diets and actually even wrote a book about Lou the hippo. Hey, a couple of other things happening here. Um, one is that we've heard a lot about is the uh, the new uh, hooping crane that's uh, been accepted into the community. Want to tell us about that? Yep, it was formerly known as 501. We call him Levi here because of the 501 jeans. Uh -huh. okay. Some of the other folks call him Romeo because he was interested in one of the female whoopers that we've had here. Uh -huh. And for the last six years, he's been stopping by. Mm -hmm. And so this year, since he stopped by and wasn't getting with the program, he'll be here from now on and we'll see if it's true love or not. So they're going to be allowed to breed? Yeah, there's a, a couple things that we do to introduce the male to the female. Mm -hmm. We'll put up a screen barrier where he can see and they can vocalize and then we'll gradually introduce each other. Mm -hmm. Okay, a little candlelight dinner maybe? Yeah. <laughs> and then the other thing is, uh, how is the, uh, you've opened up the gates this year to wild manatees, how's that working out? Yeah, that was a historical event that gates have been closed for over 30 years. The manatee population in the blue water has been increasing, and with the cold snaps that we've been getting, the extreme cold, especially after last year, we decided to open up the gates to the wild manatees. Mm -hmm. And like today, they've been coming in quite a bit. The other day, we had over 80 manatees inside the spring run. Wow. Now we have our captives sectioned off a uh, separate area so that you can see those, but once the sanctuaries go out in March, the captives will have the entire spring run back again. Okay. Oh, that's exciting. So word is spreading among the manatee community. This is a good place to winter. Yep. <laughs> and once the word gets out, I expect even more. All right. Okay. Thanks for talking with us, Art. All right. Thanks for coming. All right. <laughs> Let's everybody give him a big round of applause.